hi and welcome back to my channel so today I want to try out some new products and I have a few elf products today that I want to try so we'll be doing that today I want to do a simple look I also ordered this James Charles mini palette and I want to try that out today so in my channel you're not gonna be seeing crazy makeup looks I like to do my makeup a little natural neutral and easy and I want us to learn together because I am not an expert so I just do my makeup for fun well let's learn together so first I'm gonna be starting with the BH Cosmetics Studio Pro Ultimate Brow Palette this is the only palette I have right now for my eyebrows and since we can't really go shopping right now I don't have another eyebrow product so we're gonna be using this one today And that's it and I'm just gonna clean it up with some concealer and I'll be right back so now that I'm done with my eyebrows I want to try this new elf luminous putty primer so this is how it looks like it doesn't smell like anything Ooh, it feels like butter though I'm just gonna put some in my eye I'm gonna take a BH cosmetics brush and I am gonna dig in into this mini palette so you can't bend it all the way, but that's okay. I think I'm gonna go in in this color right here. So I wanted to talk to you guys about what's going on with the, with the YouTuber Bretman Rock. About how he said some things when he was, he was making videos and he said um, racial, a racial word in his videos. And he was making these videos when he was 15, he says. And now everybody wants to cancel him. I feel like in the makeup, I guess, community, always drama. And I knew that if I made videos of makeup and things like this, like I was probably gonna get hate. There was going to be people leaving nasty comments and I knew I was going to have to be strong about it. I put it off because of things that were going on in my life but also because I was like am I sure like I'm going to be able to handle like nasty comments. That would go through my head. I like to do makeup for fun like I really like doing makeup for fun. I am not a professional and I just like to do my makeup. For fun I liked his response because he said to cancel the kid he was when he was 15 years old you're not letting people go and learn from their mistakes because if you never make a mistake you're never gonna learn and that's my opinion on that let's just say that nobody's perfect I know I'm not perfect like I'm not even close to being perfect and I don't know anybody in my life that is perfect not one not one ever in my whole life like have I met a person that was perfect I don't think perfect exists to be honest like I said like I feel like for you to learn and look back and be like wow you know like that was really bad like I was really bad or that wasn't correct for me to do or that wasn't correct for me to say and um, and also um, you have to forgive I forgive like I, I really do forgive before I'd be like oh well this person did this to me and I'm not gonna forgive them if they continue to do that like then obviously like you don't want those people around you like they're not doing nothing good for you they're just being negative so why do you want them around you know so it's good to just be like you know what you do need to be out of my life if you continue to be this way then why do I want you in my life if I see that this person like tries is trying to like better themselves like I'm not gonna be like no you're st I'm still not talking to you or I'm, I still don't want you like in my life What's in the past, I guess it's in the past. And if you try to be a better person, that's all that matters to me. Being a better person, there you go. If you were a crappy person back then, but now you're a really good person now, like, why not? You know, I'm not gonna be stuck in the past holding a grudge. It's not good for that person, it's not good for you either, you know? Like, you need to let it go. If not, you're always gonna hold that, like, 
I guess, inside, and it's not good for you. So I'm just trying to darken my crease right here. I really don't care when it's sloppy because I go in with concealer and I clean it up or with a uh, wipe. So, I, like, I'm just having fun today. I'm not really like, oh, it has to be perfect. Like, I told you, perfect doesn't exist. So, don't come for perfectness in this channel because it's not going to happen. <laughs> it's not going to happen. I forgot what I was saying. Oh, that I had never met. I have never met someone perfect in my life. And, um,. Like I said, we all make mistakes. We all say, we all say and do dumb things, like especially when we're younger, because you're young and you really don't care. I guess you're not mature. You're not mature. There you go. That's the word I was trying to look for. You're not mature. Like at that age, like you think that everything's easy. You think that you can do whatever you want. Like you want this freedom. Like you know, like because you're immature and you don't think things like all the way through you think everything's so easy and it's not it's not and i can't say that because that's how i thought like i i was kind of like you know like oh like nothing matters you know like everything's gonna be okay nothing matters who cares like you know like you don't think all the way i guess i don't know i'm gonna make it darker so i'm gonna add i think this where is it at? this darker brown right here now that i have my babies like they're still pretty young but i still let them know like you know this is something you can't say because of this or you know don't say that because that's not correct because of this like you try to teach them because you want them to be respectful people you know like they don't you don't want it to be you want it to be better than you i that's how i feel like i want my kids to be better than me i don't want them to make the same mistakes i did you know i want them to be better than me you know i want them to be better than me and it's my job and my responsibility i feel like like to teach them to teach them and help them be better people I'll just stop because if not, we're never going to finish this eye. Look, I've been talking and talking and we're not going to finish this eye. So I'll shut up and try to finish this eye. Now I think I'm going to use this gold right here. But first I'm going to dump my brush. And this is a brush from an Ulta palette I bought one time and it came with it. And I'm not going to cut the crease or nothing like that. Like I said, you know, it's just something... I just want to do something fun. I don't I don't want to make it all complicated. <laughs> so I'm just going to add it to my eye. So I'm going to try it with my finger. Oh, yeah. I think it's crazy how like a lot of shadows, like they work better with your finger. I'm gonna be doing the other eye and then I'll be back. MAC foundation in NC25. Okay, so now I'm gonna use this Pro LA concealer because I have really bad um, under eyes. I have always had really bad under eyes. I feel like it's like genetic. I've always had them, like always, but now they're really bad because it's been years that I have trouble sleeping. Like I cannot get a good sleep. Like I think it's so weird. Like my mind keeps going and going and going. Like I cannot sleep. Like I'm. I think about like oh. You know, um, like, what am I going to do tomorrow? Like, I make a list in my mind. Like, my mind just keeps going. Like, it does not stop. I got this e.l.f. Elf 16-hour Elf camel uh, concealer. And I got it in medium sand. And hopefully, like, it's my color. And hopefully, it works.
and we're gonna use this wet and wild a mega glow contouring palette contour in caramel toffee i'm gonna take this color also gonna add some on my nose because I get really oily on my nose like it's embarrassing sometimes my nose just starts to I feel like the the foundation just vanishes like it's that bad like <laughs> my lines decrease so bad I'm gonna curl my lashes I hardly have lashes when I was small one time I got a pair of scissors and I cut off all my lashes yeah I was small well, not that small, I mean, you know, but I just, I don't know. I just went, hmm. They never grew back, like, they just didn't grow back. And I'm going to try this L'Oreal Paris Voluminous, Voluminous, Extra Volume. Um, and black is, black is black. Dude, it says black is black and I'm like black is um black jeez I only have these lashes like right now we can't be going to the store so I had gotten this um pack of lashes these um kiss jubilee fox mink lashes and they're really pretty like you know and um, these are the only ones I have, so these are the only ones I'm going to use, you know. So while my lashes are drying, I'm going to use this e.l.f. bronzer palette. Oh, it has a mirror. Colors are like that. Look a bit light, I'm not going to lie. You see this wet and wild? Like, look at the color. It's like dark. Darkish. It's like darkish. Very like... one and this one so this one was a dollar a dollar something and this one was like I think it was like four or seven I don't remember but I mean you can tell like the packaging look at this one and then look at this one always rosy I like that it's it looks kind of dark and this one's bright pink and this one looks pink like it looks pink you have to be careful because it's kind of like powdery it's it's pink like it's really pink try this one this one's not powdery and i like this color oh it's a little yeah okay this color i like oh i really like this color i think it's like really pigmented I have a Tarte palette and I only use one blush out of the whole palette and it's so beat up because I just use that color I just love that color and this color reminds me of that color because I when I seen it at the store that looks like my Tarte color like the blush I use and I got it I got it and I was like I'm gonna try it out like I said like you know what like this year has honestly been like a really I, well, it's been a bad year. Like, I feel like it's been a bad year for, like, everybody. Like, it started out bad. Like, for me, like, it really started out bad. Like, um, it just hasn't been a, a good year, I guess you can say. For every all of us, it just made me realize, like, a lot of things. On my Instagram, I had posted a picture, and um, I had put, like, you know, try new things, you know, and because life is so precious, and... And you know enjoy life I always put a little bit on my nose I don't contour my nose I just put a little bit of blush on my nose on the tip and the tip life is a gift I feel like life is a gift and sometimes like you know like it takes you a while or you don't realize you know that it's a gift like you're privileged to be here I don't really want to talk about it but like I was like you know what like you need to um, not hold back anymore you need to stop holding back 
and you need to whatever you want like go go towards that you know go towards that and and don't stop because also you're just gonna um it's just gonna stay in the back of your mind like you're gonna let time pass and it's just gonna stay in the back of your mind like i just wasted my time like you know and i didn't get to do what i wanted you know um so don't hold back you know just just do what what you want to do you know if it turns out good great if it turns out bad you know at least you know you tried it at least you know you did it and you went for it and you i guess gave it your all and you know you gotta go from there you know you're just gonna continue from there let's start gluing my lashes this brown in the corner go in with highlighter and I'm gonna be using this makeup revolution this is my favorite like and see again like I stick to the same products like I really do because like like if it works like I'm gonna continue to use it my favorite to see the NYX um, Dewy Finish Setting Spray. I'm gonna be taking this dark and this. I'm gonna be using this white, I think. Can I use some on my uh, brow? just want to um, try to blend it up here a little it's wet and wild perfect pout uh, lip liner I'm gonna use the same Ulta black gel, black gel, blackout um eyeliner pencil, <laughs> and I am gonna um clean my mole because you can't forget about the mole, okay? It's my beauty mark, so you gotta embrace that, you know. Like it's crazy. Like my mom has the same the same mole, but she has it like on the top of her lip, and I have it like over here. I know. Next, do we finish um setting spray? Done. Look at that. The highlight. Oh my goodness. It's so shiny. Like I I just love it. Like it's so yeah, let me know what kind of videos you guys want to watch and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.